data-centric approaches uh, are uh, uh, increasingly critical uh, as we, as we uh, work with materials uh, that are novel, that we don't have experience with, and the situations that are too complex to contemplate on the design uh, board in, in, uh, with their full complexity. Uh, they allow us uh, a couple of things. First, uh, uh, we can bypass any model inaccuracies that may have crept into the design process. Uh, so we deal directly with the data. With the data. Uh, uh, they, uh, of course, we, would, we still need to interpret the data in light of models, but we have room to account for fluctuations and errors in the models. Uh, second, uh, they also uh, uh, allow us to uh, be uh, to, to fashion design uh, to fashion our uh, actions to specific situations, so rather than uh, reacting to a statistical sample that you may have encountered in the lab, our reactions uh, would be uh, based on the specific sample from which the data was collected. Well, uh, these data-centric approaches actually are relevant throughout the engineering process in design, uh, manufacturing, uh, and control. They, uh, in, in the context of design, for instance, they. Uh, uh, they allow us to, uh, to contemplate, at least, uh, if, if not yet implement, uh, uh, sensing networks as part of the design process and be able to perhaps uh, revise the safety factors as function of the data that's being collected. Uh, of course, that's uh, still ways off, perhaps, but as the community grows and as the methodologies mature, uh, I'm sure that we will be moving in that direction. The growth in data science is, uh, is multifaceted and has been uh, across the whole spectrum of engineering. Uh, there are very few journals right now, if any, that uh, contemplate the breadth uh, of, of, uh, of the spectrum. Uh, a journal uh, like data-centric engineering uh, brings together these different constituencies, uh, uh, bring to brings together methodologies developed across different applications and allows them to feed off each other. I think uh, the, the, the audiences who are visionary, who are uh, interested in, uh, uh, in uh, bringing the, the, the latest and greatest technologies to their workspace uh, would benefit and should be, uh, should be pursuing this journal.